everyone welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be teaching you how to do this eye look on this specific eyeshadow technique it's basically what I like to call here. I basically call this technique a half cut crease because you're not really going all the way across the lid so to start off with I'm going to be using primer Mac painterly all over the lid now I'm going to use Mac mylar which is a matte white and a blending brush and I'm just going to apply that all over the lid Next, I'm going to take an angled liner brush and I'm using Sigma E65. I'm going to dip this into MAC Saddle, which is a really nice neutral, oops, neutral color. So, and I'm using this small angle because I want to basically create a very sharp line for that kind of like half cut crease look. So here, normally I put my liner at the edge of my brow. So I'm basically just guessing where I'm gonna put this and hope for the best. Now I'm going to take one side is thicker than the other just because my eyes, my crease bone is not the same in my eyes, so sometimes depending on where my brush lands, I have to kind of change it up a little bit, but I mean, it's fine if it's not perfect, it's okay. So now I'm going to take a blending brush and I'm just kind of want to blend out these edges. Next I'm going to take the Sigma blending brush E36. I'm going to dip, dip it back into saddle and I'm going to blend this out more. Now I'm going to take another blending brush and I'm going to be using the Sigma E25. I'm going to dip it into Swiss chocolate which is a really nice rich brown and I'm just going to darken up these sides here. Now I'm going to take the Sigma E36 brush and uh, that I used to dip into the saddle for the original blending out and now I'm going to dip it into Deep Damson which is a really nice rich burgundy color and I'm just going to darken this crease a little bit. More so towards the bottom. Okay, so now I'm going to take the same angle brush that I used to create the line and I'm going to dip that into Deep Damson just because I want a really defined line. I'm just going to darken this. Now I'm going to take a MAC 217 brush and I'm just, I'm not going to, I haven't added any color onto it and I'm just going to blend out the top of this here because I find it's a little bit too harsh. Okay, now I'm going to use a white glittery shadow and I'm going to be using the Sigma Eye Shading E55. I'm just going to dip it into any plain glittery satin white. I'm going to be using a Sephora white base. I've had it for a really long time. And I'm just going to pat this over the shadow, the Mac Myler that I had there originally. Just being aware to not get too close to the that straight line there. This is just because I want my lids to be super, super bright. And I'm going to go in with another pigment after this. So today I'm going to be using a Calvin Just Mineral Eye Polish in Orchid. And I'm uh, what I'm actually doing is I'm taking the little applicator and I'm just dumping this onto like a little plastic thing. Um, I've already dumped some out here and I'm going to wet the brush that I'm going to be using. So the brush that I'm going to be using is a Sigma Shader Lid E56 and I'm just going to spray some Fix Plus onto it and I'm going to dip this into the loose polish. Polish, shadow, pigment, whatever you want to call it. Just going to shake some of it off.
So I've just finished finished applying the eyeshadow and now I'm gonna go in with the Sigma Eyeliner E11 in MAC Black Track and I'm gonna outline where I want to put my liquid liner. Now I'm going to go in with NYC Liquid Liner on top. My eyes are almost complete, so now I'm going to go in and apply my concealer. And I'm using LA Girl Pro Conceal, HD Pro Conceal High Definition Concealer. I'm going to go in with a concealer brush. I'm using Sigma Concealer F75. Now I'm going to use Makeup Addiction Cosmetics Brush The Queen. And I'm just going to blend my concealer out. Now I'm going to use the Anastasia Contour Kit in the color Vanilla and I'm just going to set my concealer. So now I'm going to go in and finish my eyes. I've applied my blush and highlighter. So today I'm going for the inner highlight. I'm going to be using, this is a really old palette from Morphe and they don't sell it anymore. Um, oh. So I'm just fill out. Uh, so you can just get, this is the color that I'm going to be using. It's just a really light, light pale green color. Um, it's really gorgeous. But you can get palettes like this from Coastal Scents, I believe. Now I'm going to go ahead and finish and I'm going to put a little bit of eyeshadow on the bottom of my lids. And I'm going to go in and use... Um... Hold on one second. I need to check my Instagram because I don't remember. So I'm going to go in and use a crown brush, the pencil end, and MAC Saddle. Yes. And I'm just going to apply this. It's a postman coming. So next I'm going to take a NYX retractable eyeliner in white. And I'm just going to... So now I'm going to finish off with lips and I'm using No Bleed Lips because I want to wear a bright lip today. This is just a wax pencil basically and it prevents bleeding. Now I'm going to go in with NYX Cosmetics Lip Liner in Natural. Alright, so my camera died, then I had to wait for it to charge and now I'm back. So now I'm going to take Wet n Wild Don't Blink Pink. Wet n Wild lipsticks are amazing and they're so cheap. The bomb diggity. Anyways. Get focused, Miriam. I don't feel like I can really get the edges all that well, so I'm actually going to take a brush, a lip brush. This is, um, this is actually from the drugstore, just a plain old lip brush. Uh, did this in. So now I'm going to go in with a lip gloss and I'm going to be using NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss and I actually don't know. I think the name is Cosmo Net. I'm not sure. I bought this a really long time ago. And I'm just gonna, it's a really nice pink shimmer. I'm just 
just gonna apply that over top. Thanks for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Uh, this is the final look. As always, I will put all the information to the products that I use down below in the box. And as well, you can find me on Snapchat, Instagram at Freckled Glam. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Perfect. Bye bye. Never worn gloss with bright lipstick before. I should do it more often. So the postman never came. And I like kind of need him to come now. I want my package. Jeez. Bye bye.